Well, we got the, um, the, the trade data on Friday. Uh, so we talked about that at the open. Uh, here we're talking about, uh, so that's your. What is the big driver of this? I mean, if you look at the chart, obviously it's a very positive. For, on the, for yeah. as, as it relates to the trade, trade data, yeah, I mean, it, you know, like, was there a, some component that turned turn positive? That yeah, well, a lot of it is, um, yeah, I guess, on a trend basis, you'd be talking about petroleum exports oh, improving. Okay. Gotcha. But it, the biggest driver in this, if we can go back to the slides, we should actually show soybean exports. Um, so there you go. Um, so soybean exports in uh, in June. Remember that soybeans have become your proxy for the state of trade relations, just because yep. sixty percent of production goes to China. You've seen soybean futures down almost twenty four percent off highs of just a couple months so, ago. So as part of the you know the positive trade deficit, soybean like front 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 running of soybeans effectively. Exactly. Get it, get them out while you can before the tariffs hit. So yep. you can see that in that chart. So soybean exports were up almost 90%, almost a double sequentially, month yep. over month, up 105% year over year. Yep. Um, so we're talking about you know over $4 billion seasonally adjusted. Um, so that was a primary driver, at least in, in the June data. Yep. Um, you can see the impact, um, or I guess by you know indirectly the impact here on the next chart, this is your goods trade balance that we showed before. Um, so we're showing the, the quarter over quarter trade uh, change in the trade balance. Uh, that's your, uh, your gray bars, um, and we're showing uh, the uh, net exports as a, as a percent of GDP, so contribution to, to GDP there in the black, and you can see they move together directionally, yep. uh, particularly when you get outsized moves, and you can see the goods trade balance is, is currently tracking up 9.1% quarter over quarter, so net exports should, uh, should provide a solid uh, contribution to, to GDP in, in the second quarter uh, in a reversal from a modest drag uh, in, in the first quarter.